The U.S. Geological Survey is nearly done with a project that could help predict flooding on the Chocolate River. They're installing a stream gauge that will measure the level, discharge, and speed of the river. There are already 160 stream gauges set up in rivers and streams around Michigan. The U.S. Geological Survey chose the Chocolate River in part because it feeds into Lake Superior. Before you can really make any kind of a management plan for a river, you need to know how much water you have and what are its highs and what are its lows. Part of, of uh, doing uh, drought, maybe drought forecasting or flood forecasting is knowing how much water the basin is producing to begin with. The project costs $23,500 and it should be finished in the next few weeks. It will become part of a national network of stream gauges that are used for water management and flood prediction.